So Apex Legends Mobile has some crazy movement that all the pro players are using to destroy lobbies. In this video, I'm going to show you three simple movement techniques that's going to make you play 10 times better, and it's going to let you jump slide into those DMs of Loba. <laughs> Make sure you like and subscribe and let's turn you pro. Let's go. Okay, let's get straight into movement number one, guys, which is the wall bounce. A wall bounce is where your legend runs up to a wall and bounces off of it in a certain direction. The wall bounce is very tricky to learn in Apex Mobile, but once you do learn it, you can use it to get in and out of sticky situations and style on the enemy. Usually on PC and console of the game, you can run alongside a wall and hit a successful wall bounce to boost you forward, but on mobile, it's a lot different. Now, to hit a wall bounce, all you have to do is run up to a flat wall jump into it and as you are mid jump let go of the joystick and double tap the jump button to bounce off of the wall if you are still holding the joystick when trying to do this then it won't work once you have hit the wall bounce you can move the joystick again to go in any direction you want to unfortunately the only way to wall bounce is having your legend face the wall directly if you are running up alongside the wall and you try to do it while sprinting it won't work it only works if you are basically at a certain angle which is rubbish because on PC and console again you can do it at any angle hopefully the developers change this so we can all war bounce anywhere but a good way to practice is going into the firing range and testing it out on the angles yourself there's a lot of walls in there that you can do this once you've got it locked down it'll be much easier in the actual game okay now movement number two a lot of people don't actually know about this but there's a move called the quick climb bounce in the game when you try to climb over an obstacle or a fence there is a small climbing feature that slows you down when trying to vault over something one quick way to avoid your legend going into this climbing feature is wall bouncing over it. Now this technique only works on obstacles that are at a certain height but what you need to do is sprint up to it do a normal wall bounce routine by sliding first to gain momentum. Next, press the jump button and let go of the joystick, the same as the wall bounce. As soon as you hug or touch the wall, hit the jump button to bounce off of it and immediately hold the joystick in which direction you want to vault. As you can see here, my character goes up to the wall, slides into it, and then I vault over it with ease really, really quickly. Now this move is a little trickier to learn, but I would suggest, again, going into the firing range to practice it so you you can do it in the game as it has saved me a lot especially when you're trying to escape from the enemy all right so the last move i want to teach you guys is called the jump slide or the jump cancel or the cancel jump whatever you guys want to call it now this move is probably one of the most overused and overpowered movement techniques in apex mobile and the community has a lot of mixed feelings about it now the jump slide is very easy to learn all you have to do is sprint forward hit a slide and then jump into the air once you're in the air hit the slide again and it feels like your legend gets pulled down to the ground, which basically puts you into another slide. Now, as you are doing this, all you need to do is move your cursor from left to right and just picture your legend as a car. Think of him as he's drifting from left to right and then just keep repeating this. Now, this move you can't do forever. It basically slowly loses momentum, but after the fourth time, if you wait for around three seconds after using it, then you can basically do it again. The way I like to picture it is move your cursor basically like in a figure of eight. So you're going from left to right, from left to right as a momentum in one movement. Once you've got this locked down, it offers insane movement speed in fights and it makes it a lot harder to get shot at. In future, this move could get nerfed as it offers a massive skill gap between players, but some people love using it, including myself, as it looks insane. It basically gives you the option to really slide and really juke your enemies when you're fighting them. Now, this was a quick video just showing you those three tips, guys. So I hope it's helped you. If you've got any questions down below on how to do it, feel free to drop a comment or question down below. The support has absolutely been incredible, guys. I've just dropped the winners for the last two giveaways on my last few videos. So make sure you go check those out. I'm live streaming every single day, doing even more giveaways. And all you have to do is come and join me on Trovo. You can find a link in the pinned comments and in the description, and you can actually come and play some viewer games with me. I play games with you guys all the time and i appreciate all the support on the videos guys honestly it's been an amazing global launch for me and my personal channel i've got some big announcements coming soon but that's the end of this video so thank you guys for watching if you liked make sure you hit a like hit a subscribe comment down below if you've got any questions and i'll catch you legends in the next one peace